Hey gang, so we've got some really exciting news here. Um, some, not all, but some of my Apex Pro 24s and Apex CB24 irons have arrived here. So this is kind of a first look at them. I've just put them in my carry bag here and I have to replace the uh, Apex 19s that I have. So we're gonna first take a look at this beautiful six iron in the Apex Pro 24 variant here. So if we pull this out, we can see it has a really nice clean design with the apex here. It's a six iron. On this golf club specifically, I have the Golf Pride Standard Tour Velvet Align with one of my favorite shafts on the market, the KBS S Taper 130 Extra Stiff, 130 gram extra stiff shaft here. And uh, it should be noted that I have these golf clubs two degrees flat because I am 5'8". So if we take a look at these golf clubs with a dress, you can really tell that it is a thicker top line. So if we take a look, these are the Apex Pro 19s and these are also two degrees flat. So we're gonna compare the 24s to the 19s. And you're gonna notice that the top line of the Apex Pro 24 is thicker and the overall club face is larger than the Apex 19 Pros. And why I think Callaway did that was because the Pros used to be the top of the line kind of muscle cavity blade irons that Callaway was going for. And now they introduced the cavity backs and the muscle backs into the lineup. So these are now a in-between club which is still a player's distance club between the apex cbs and the apex golf clubs so the reason why i got the four through six in my set with the apex pros was because uh, i liked the yardage i was getting with them they were about five to ten yards longer when I tested each seven iron out comparably between the CBs and the pros so that should be noted um, the CBs I was pretty confident at 180 carry or you know right around there and then the pros was anywhere from or the CBs I should or no I mean the pros sorry the pros were right around 185 to 190 carry for that seven iron depending on you know, where I hit it on the club face or not. But I found these pros to be extremely forgiving and that's why I went with my longer irons uh, with the pros. So I'm pretty confident here that because of that thicker top line and it is not a blacked out club, so that could be playing a little bit of tricks on my eyes, but uh, these will be more forgiving and add more distance to my overall game. It also should be noted that the new pros are one degree stronger than the standard apex pros from previous years and the cbs so i'm very very curious to see uh these on the actual golf course and see how they you know perform but overall i love the look of these here um i mean i love these apex 19s too but these just give me a little bit more inspiring uh feeling when i step up to the ball especially during testing now we move to the holy grail of Callaway golf clubs, in my opinion. So right now you're looking at the bird's eye view angle of the Apex CBs. So right away you can tell there is less offset in this golf club. There is less of a top line. This is one of the cleanest, if not the cleanest looking Apex club that I have seen. And you can already see there is a dent Oh no, there's a little dent on the CBs. So these are of course a forged forged steel golf club. Um, again, during testing on a simulator, I noticed that these were about five to 10 yards shorter per club. So to make up for that, I have these two degrees flat. I kept the same S taper, extra stiff 130 gram shaft in there. And these are one degree stronger than standard to hopefully make up for some of that gap between the pros and the CBs in the set. But wow, taking a look at this over the top, this is definitely one of the purest golf clubs I've seen. I like the toe 
size in relation to the sweet spot in relation to the heel. This gives you just a very confident look that you can bring it back and cut into the turf with it and make a good strike. I really, really like this. One thing I do have to say, though, I wish the face of the golf club was a little bit more toned down in terms of its chrome like the back is. It's a little shiny, but we'll live with that. Again, I have been playing with these Apex Pro 19s since 2019, so I am used, used to that smoked-out black look, and these will be forever missed. But... Just a little update here on my golf clubs that I'm using. I, of course, am going to do a review on these once I get on the actual golf course. I can't right now because there is snow on the ground, but these are uh, great golf clubs. and I'm really, really excited to uh, get these out on the course and see what I can shoot with them.